it's tough to build a dynasty in collegiate sports. I end the current collegiate landscape, there are only a few dynasties left that have stood the test of time. There's the Sanbita Sea Lions, who won 17 straight championships, the UE women's fencing team, who are gunning for an 11th straight tiara, the Sanbita Red Lions, who have won 10 of the last 12 seniors basketball crowns, the Sanbita Lady Red Paddlers, who have just won their sixth straight championship, and the DLSU Lady Spikers, who have won six of the last eight championships in the highly competitive UP Women's Volleyball Tournament. Then there's the Adamson softball team, the gold standard in team sports at the collegiate level. Over the last eight years, the Lady Falcons have only lost four games, and this included a streak that lasted 73 games. So every after the National University Lady Bulldogs season, head coach Patrick Aquino also kept an eye on softball, a second semester sport, to see how they are and how to improve his program. Which is why, when the Lady Bulldogs broke the all-time whoop record for consecutive wins in a team sport last Saturday, Aquino made sure to pay tribute to them. I am just happy that we have the streak now, but we would not take away what the Adamson softball team did, Aquino told tiebreaker times on behalf of his team. They have their own story to tell and their own history. As a fan of sports as well, Aquino disclosed that his sources of motivation are the best sporting programs in the country. Coach Ana Santiago did her job and her team made history that we can't forget also, he added. We will not be here without them doing the streak first.